YouTubers, it's a Wednesday, I can't remember the exact date but I'll put it at the bottom. Um, I've done quite a lot, we've done quite a lot down the allotment. Um, I won't do a tour until Saturday and then I'll put all these clips together and um, edit it and upload it Saturday night, hopefully. Hopefully it doesn't take too long. Um, but today um, I'm going to be doing the fairy garden. I'm going to sort it all out, get all these nettles out. I'm going to take all the plants out, all the stones. I'm going to clean up the stones. Um, take everything out, put a layer of compost in. Then I'm going to get a um, compost sack and line it. So hopefully no weeds come through. Then I put the plants through the uh, compost sack into the into the ground, and then reorganise it. And then uh, yeah, but the first job is to take that rose bush and the nettles out. So I'll pause this now, and I'll come back to you after I've taken it out. Right, I've taken the rose bush out now, and uh, all the plants. Kizzy, what you been up to? I've been like sorting rocks out, like the. And the colourful one. Go and get one. Right. Are they somewhere? There. We put water in a bucket and then got bleach. And I'm sorting out all the stones. Not worrying about these tiny ones, but the big ones. Yeah, just the big ones. And after all that's done, what I'm going to do is I'm going to take all the weeds out because the only thing left in there now is weeds. I'm going to take all the weeds out. I'm going to dig over a little bit with a trowel. And uh, we're going to top it up with some more compost. And then I'm going to put a... Flush! Yeah, lovely. <laughs> and then I'm going to put um, a split up compost bag on it. So it stops the weeds coming through. Yeah, that's another one to go in the bucket. That's a really nice one. Yeah, that's a really nice one. Um, I'm going to cut through the compost bag, put the plants through, and then we're going to sort the stones out and put all the stones back again and yeah. then that will be done and we'll show you what it looks like afterwards I don't know whether it's going to be today or tomorrow no. we'll get most of it done today but I reckon we'll have to finish it off tomorrow but I'll bring the camera down again to, well my phone down again tomorrow and we'll show you what's what's been done Hi, right, hello there you, again YouTubers, it's uh, now Thursday, I will get that right because I keep somehow, for some reason, thinking it's not a Wednesday, but it's not, it's a Thursday, um, I'll put the date along the bottom, um, fairy garden, it's getting there, um, I put some plants in yesterday as you can see, I um, put, put some holes in and put the plants through. Um, Kizzy's still sorting out the stones there, giving them a good wash for me. Yes. Yeah. And the sawing you can hear is Jason back there. We were going to make that into a composting toilet. But. But, yeah, yeah, big but. But. Um, the committee have decided it's not a good idea. So we're now turning it into a um, little storage shed and we're going to be putting polythene around there. You can see a bit at the back there. Look, it's taking my fingernails. Um, <laughs> um, yeah, that's what you get for gardening. Um, we're going to be putting with some plastic along that part and around and on the top. And we're going to put some seedlings in there because we need the space. Um, let me go and show you the state of the greenhouse at the moment. The sun's setting now. It's getting quite late, it's starting to get a bit chilly. But um, yeah, this is the greenhouse at the moment. Um, quite full. Let's sort this out. Here we go, We've got plants all the way along there. We've got onions on that part. At the front, I've got a square pot there. I've got some black cherry tomatoes. I'm going to have to prick out tomorrow, put into individual pots. And then they'll be going on the free table. Got brassicas along there. Let me move you a bit closer. 
we've had to put these pallets in here let's try and that's it we've had to put a couple of pallets in here for more space um yeah they're the brassicas there underneath that bottle i've got a chili pepper um that chili pepper under that bottle is called a Californian Wonder, which is um, 30,000 Scovilles on the Scoville scale. Um, tomorrow I've got to come down. I've got to um, put on the other chilies, which are just there. We've got... That one there is the Carolina Reapers. Some of them don't look very healthy at the moment. It's probably because it's a bit too small in there, so I've got to put them on tomorrow. And in that one, we've got the uh, Morgana Scorpions. Um, Round this way. And down here. In the small red pots there, we've got uh, black cherry tomatoes. We've got three Lediva um cucumbers I nearly forgot what they were then and at the back i've got some lilies um these pots here are all my tomatoes that's white uh, tomato white wonder and alicante i've got some more onions right there more tomatoes can't remember what's in that pot i think that pot is lilies there's another lily there um, in these pots here, I've got my bush beans. That's, um, hold on. I've got the packet here. What ones are they? French bean maxi dwarf. Those ones from Marshalls. So they're in those two there. And that one over there. Um, I've taken some hebe cuttings. I've got some sweet pepper up there. In that pot there, I've got fennel. And I've got some more onions there in that trolley. Got radishes along the bottom. Excuse the carrier bag. Um, oh. um, those two there are, so I think they're Socrates cucumbers. Got radish down there, a couple of lettuce, and I've got my leeks in there. Got me peas and guttering along there. <laughs> um, hold on a second. Uh, let's move you again. Put it down there. Oh, and um, we were given some Brussels sprouts, so they're in there. I've got to put on some more of these in that tray and we've got some more radish down there I'll have to move that pot in a minute so that's in the greenhouse and as you can see we're very slowly running out of room oh I forgot in these black pots I've put my sweet corn out um, what else have we been doing um, not too much at the moment um Yeah, I've shown Huh? No, I didn't show me smiley faces. I'll do that another time. But yeah, that's what we've been doing today. Whew. It's about a past 7ish now, so we're thinking about Thinking about going home in a minute. It's starting to get chilly. Thinking, you should know. No, I'm thinking. I don't know yet. No, we're not. Home. <laughs> I will see what your dad wants to do after he's sawn that bit of wood. But yeah, we're a bit um, a bit upset about them not allowing us to do a composting toilet. They're dumb. They don't know what they're doing. But they think that if we go home, there we, might be. You mean if, if we give up the plot? Yeah, there might be a waste. Yeah, 
Because you can't use it until 18. 18 months. Right, never mind. Yeah, yeah, your dad's thought of something else to use use for it, so. He, there's always things we can use that building for, so. Anyway, I'm going to sign off for now. Um, I'll, we're coming down again tomorrow. I'll do a bit more. I'm not. No, well, you are coming down and then going from here. Yeah. Yeah, she's going away for a little while. She's going to her sister's, so. I'm free. And we're getting the other one back. She's not helpful with me. I'm a charm. She's a, she's the devil. Actually, no, I'm the devil. She's the other. <laughs> yeah, okay. Right, anyway, I'll sign off for now. So, I'll see you later. Bye. Uh -huh. As the sun goes down on the 5th of April, um, I thought I'd do a new little segment where I just mull things over a little bit. So it's going to be mulling over in the greenhouse. Anyway, so this week, um, the rain. I know a lot of you have had, in England, have had a lot of rain uh, just recently. Um, but... This month we've had none. Last month we had none. It's been a good month, month and a half since we've had a single drop of rain down here. Um, which means our plot rent is going to be going up this year. Oh, hello Bumblebee. No, you can't get out that way. You can't get out of glass. But yeah, um... 
with the amount of, I mean, the ground is so dry. That <laughs> bumblebee wants to be on the camera, I'm sure he does. <laughs> but no, um, it's been just, it's just been so dry. We've had to water virtually every night. Um, luckily, the greenhouse won't need watering tonight. Everything seems, the soil seems pretty damp, so I'll leave it for the night. Um, the water butt that we've got is, it started out absolutely full. And in the last week, it's now down to about half, maybe less. Um, it's just crazy that there's just been no rain. Beautiful blue sky, lovely heat, but it's getting to the point now where we could do with a little bit of rain, you know. So I, I don't know what, I don't know where whereabouts everybody is. Um, I don't know whether you've had rain or you've been having a problem with rain. But if you're having a problem with rain, can you send it to Essex, please? <laughs> so, um, yeah, that's about, that's, that's my mulling over, I think. It's just weird. Usually this time of year it's downpours all the time. It's just been nothing. Nothing at all. Like I say, there's no clouds in the sky. I haven't seen one single cloud all day today. Yesterday there was a few clouds. But it's just strange. Like I say, this time of year we use usually got downpours all the time but uh, nothing at all this year yet hopefully we'll get some rain and um hopefully it won't be a week's worth in a day or something because then we'll have floods but that bumblebee's still in here come on bumble wait you go at the door no that's not the door Oh yeah, he's found he's found an exit. <laughs> anyway, that's that's my mulling over for this week. Um, I might do it once a week. Might just do it once a month. Um, but we're packing up now, ready to go home. The sun's going down. It's still nice out. It's starting to get a little bit chilly, but yeah. So, bye for this week. Hi there guys, I'm just going to do a quick tour now. Um, to be honest, not really much is happening. Um, in the shed greenhouse. Still got these, I've got to pot these on soon because some of them are getting true leaves. And some of flowers there. Calendulas and foxgloves and cosmos and dahlias and... That one that I can't pronounce. <laughs> That's the safflowers there starting to come up some white beetroot there just put the kettle on um malikas have got bigger we're we're having to water now um because there's been no rain now for god oh, i well over a month now um off into the greenhouse i did a clip earlier saying what we've got in here but they're getting bigger. Looks like we're losing a few of our brassicas to something. Looks like they've been nibbled by something. I don't know what. I'm going to put some coffee grounds on them in a little while. Just in case slugs have got in here. Um, yeah, tomatoes are going really well. I'm going to have to put those in soon. The white wonders are going to be going into this bed. Along with some with the cucumbers. Five cucumbers at the back should fit in. And tomatoes. Still got the lettuce down there which are growing along well. Radishes are doing well. I thought they would do. Um, in the greenhouse temperatures. Let's see if I can... Hopefully the sun isn't on it too much. Um, it's been... Four, highest has been 40.2, lowest... 4.6 at the moment 27.4 um we're actually going to leave that paint out of the greenhouse 
because it gives a bit of ventilation in. Saves us coming down every day to uh, um, open the greenhouse windows. Um, <coughs> the door's been open all day as well, so it's not done too bad. Um, today I've been uh, this a minute. sorting out the netting on the brassica cage. I've got to secure that bit of netting to the top. Um, we'll bring a pair of scissors down tomorrow and I'll cut it off. We've got a standing knife, but the blade needs renewing and yeah. Um, garlic's not doing too badly. I don't know whether this is a soft neck or a hard neck. Um, if anybody else gets uh, garlic from Wilco's in the autumn, can you let me know if it's a soft neck or a hard neck? So I know whether it's going to flop or whether it's going to <laughs> wait for the yeah, first, I think it's two or three leaves at the bottom to die off. Then you know it's ready. Um, but yeah, that's them. <sighs> Got the broad beans there. I think we've had pigeons nibbling the uh, leaves. I'm not sure. Is that pigeons? Or is it something else entirely? We don't know. It's Nobody knows. Um, these are Bunyard's exhibition. That's all I do remember. Um, the new, what we're going to call the chilli shed, because I'm going to grow chilies in it, because it's so blooming hot in there. Yeah. <laughs> That's going up quite nicely. Move it backwards, yeah. Um, that's about all there is to report at the moment. I've taken a clip of the uh, pond, which you would have probably seen already. Um, once the chilli shed's sorted, we're going to be sorting out these uh, strawberries. Giving them a good weed and getting a netting ready to go over it. And after that's done, I've got that to do again. Still got to finish off re weeding the flower beds. Got my tulips coming out now. Yes. And we've got a strawberry in the uh, flower bed, but uh, we'll sort that out. Pots are coming along great. Looks like I've got the start of some flower heads on me aquilegia. <coughs> yeah, it's all going good. Round to the uh, rhubarb. God, I've got to have some more. Um, yeah. I harvested about half of that the other day and it's gone crazy again. What can you do? It's just as well we know a lot of people that like rhubarb crumble. Carrots haven't come up yet. These ones are sugar snacks. Those ones are resist to fly. But yeah, that's about it. Um, so there we go. Let me take my seat. Just wait for this kettle to boil. But yeah, that's that's the uh, that's the plot at the moment. Not much. Not much in. Still a lot of work to do. We're coming down every day now, literally every day. You can just see them in the chilli shed. <laughs> oh, I better go and help him move this. So, thanks for watching. Please like, comment, and subscribe. And we'll see you next week. Bye, bye.